हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू फ्री ऑटोमेशन लर्निंग चैनल एंड माय नेम इज चिराग इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस हाउ वी कैन इंटीग्रेट एपीएम विद जंकिंस हाउ वी कैन राइट द कोड सो दैट वी कैन इंटीग्रेट जंकिंस विद एपीएम एंड व्हेन आई क्लिक ऑन बिल्ड नाउ बटन माय एपीएम मींस माय मोबाइल ऑटोमेशन विल स्टार्ट एंड for this we are using apm tool and guys who do not watch my apm series which you can go and watch that over here so i recommended that you should watch my apm mobile automation by watching before watching this uh, video and you can also watch test ng framework videos and maybe because by using three this three playlist i am writing the code and you should have the basic idea of apm test ng and maybe right so let me show the code which i am going to run i am using a same project page object model which i showed in last video in this uh, page object model i create a base class where i you can see i write all the code to launch apm server uh, apm application right and for page as we are using page object model so i have created different class according their page name this is a home page so home page object contains all the web element which contains on the home page login page object class contain all the element on login page so you can see here i used android find by and put identify this user text field by id right and these all things i discuss already discussed in apm how uh, playlist how we can identify mobile element so you have any confusion please go and watch that in this video i am not going to discuss this uh, things right and this is about a object and this or about the method the method which i write or need to use my login test test script right so what i did here i just uh, create a class which is a login class and created a object login page object and this login page object contains all the mobile element after that i created a constructor and by using constructor i as i already show you that i created a driver apm driver on base class so i passed on this apm driver over here right and after that we will click on the button we will pass the button all the information or all the task which i have to do on my mobile app so i write over here right after that login on test i called all this method here so this is all the generic idea but in details i will create a separate video how we create page object model by using apm and selenium web driver or i will create a common page object model which can handle or which can support selenium web driver and apm at a same time right so these all the things my stats script is same which i used on selenium web driver it just launch uh, my wordpress application and enter username and password right so what i do here i just go and let me first uh, i will go and create a new job right so let me click on junkins and click on new items here i write apm job 
and I choose freestyle project and click on OK. As I already discussed all this information, all this option in my previous videos, guys who do not watch, please go and watch. As in source code man management, I am using none, and so I need to copy my all code under workspace manually. So I will do that, and in this build. add build i used execute windows patch command because i'm using windows so here i will put dir first apply save and will run first job to check my build means my jenkins job is corrected saved or not so you can see the new apm job server has been created so what i do here i just copy all my code let me apm job right and what i do i just go or maybe okay I'm doing I'm just copy my code this is my code right and if I see over here this is the same code let me click on base yes this is the same code which I have to run so let me copy this code from here to my workspace under APM job right so I copied my job all code over here right what i do i run my code on jenny motion emulator i already run my this uh, apm server right so what i do here i just go back to my jenkins and configure here i will write ambient test instead of dir so let me write ambient test now what my code do my code just go and in go to this apm job uh, go to this apm job and it will see in here form and will execute ambient test right so as i discussed that i write the uh, under base class this mobile invoke uh, or apm code over here so it will start running that code right so let me click on apply and save after that we will click on build now so you can see the build now building the jenkins job and let me open my emulator right and soon my application will launch and after that it will enter username and password right so this for Jenkins you should open this uh, emulator or you wanna to run on mobile so mobile should uh, attach with this Jenkins you can see username and now password will entered by my job right so uh, what i am saying that uh, to run through apm uh, um, to run apm code through jenkins you should uh, connect your real device on if you wanna to run through node jenkins node you can should attach that mobile device on node or if you are running on master then you should uh, attach your or run emulator on master 
so that's uh, after that it will run right same way how i run the code now we will see the log you can see one test is passed successfully right so this is all about the how we can integrate our jenkins with apm hopefully you like this video and you understand how we can do or run apm integrate apm with jenkins and selenium web driver with jenkins and if you have any query you have any suggestion you can give me mail or you can send me a mail you can comment your comments under comment section and thank you for watching this video bye bye take care